Hello everyone, this is John again here with my 3D printing channel and I want to show you while I do it live for the first time Thank you Mango My bird is going to yell during this whole thing because he hears me talking So this is a reusable filament spool called the Master Spool There's some variants of it out there but the idea is that you don't end up with a bunch of spools in your work center or your space so you just kind of re reuse the same spools over and again and the reason we're able to do that is because the top pops off and the spools are sold in a specific packaging way that allows you to do this. So I ordered this from the link in the description. I don't know who it is. I'll go back and refer you to that. But you know, here it is, Fusion Filaments, Radioactive Orange. And I really like this kind of uh, cool look looking color when I make um, Iron Man stuff because then it gives me a, something like when I paint it, I can tell exactly where the problems are. So we're going to go through this for the first time and what I'm seeing here is that that's a little hole where that little piece of filament goes. So I'm going to line that up. Kind of line that up a little bit and then guide that right into that hole. I don't think it really matters if it gets in there or not. We'll see. Okay, that's lined up. Now, you don't want to do anything just yet with this. We still got to put on the top. And this was a little tricky to get off. Uh, I just put a little bolt in there and I unlocked the one-way locks. But it seems like it's just going to just sit down and lock in, just like that, exactly. So now we have a whole ass full spool of filament and we're gonna make sure we identify the top right there. And then cut off the zip ties. And then pull it off. Ooh. Pull off the extra. And there we go. We have a nice big spool of filament that's ready to untangle. Ready to print. I've already measured this spool and it's at 149. So when I measure again, it should be 149 plus 1,000, and let's see what we got. A little bit over 1,000. So now I know where I'm starting, and I'll know exactly how much filament I have as I go. That's it for this quick video. Have a good one.